If I ask you a question that how many oceans are there and if you are going to answer 4 then my friend your answer was absolutely right before 8 June 2021 Now you might be wondering why I was right before 8 June but not now so you are going to get the answer of your question in this video so please watch the video till the end Hello everyone welcome to study wind i hope you all are fine so let's get started without wasting the time Till now you all were learning from your books atlas and maps that there are four oceans in the world but if you gonna say the same thing now then it's not correct because a new ocean has been recognized on 8 June 2021 before exploring further let me guess something are you also thinking why 8 June only why not any other day so if your general knowledge section is well boosted you might surely be aware that on 8 June world oceans day is observed every year That is why National Geographic has officially recognized a new ocean named Southern Ocean on this day. This extends the number of total oceans to 5. Let's have a look at the 5 oceans on the map. Here is the Pacific Ocean. This is Atlantic Ocean. Here it is Indian Ocean and at the North Pole it is Arctic Ocean. And the last new one is here on the Southern Pole that is Southern Ocean. Here a notable point about this ocean is that it shares boundaries with three of the three recognized oceans that is Atlantic Ocean, Indian Ocean and Pacific Ocean. Arctic Ocean is not in contact with the Southern Ocean. This ocean surrounds Antarctica and it extends to 60 degrees south latitude from the continental coastline. Here is a point to note that Drake Passage and Scotia Arc are not considered a part of Southern Ocean. Drake Passage is the only natural body which connects Atlantic with Pacific Ocean. Most importantly, I would like to tell you that the boundary of this ocean is not marked on the basis of any landmass like other oceans. There is an ocean current which runs approximately around 60 degrees south and this ocean current defines the boundary zone of Southern Ocean. The name of this ocean current is Antarctic Circumpolar Current that is ACC. ACC runs around Antarctica and bring about colder and less salty water. The ecology of the Southern Ocean is therefore very unique because of ACC. Thousands of distinctive species are found in Southern Ocean. This ocean has not emerged out at once. It always existed there only, but it wasn't recognized. Although many countries believed on the existence of a separate ocean around Antarctica and many organizations were using this name as well. National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration which is a government institute of United Nations has officially recognized the Southern Ocean in February 2021. International Hydrographic Organization which is a prestigious organization established in 1921 with 94 countries as its member at present. IHO release standard maps every year to maintain same nomenclature of geographic locations. IHO has still not recognized the new fifth ocean because the countries of IHO have not reached on the stage of agreement regarding the recognition of Southern Ocean in the year 2000 but it may recognize it soon Now the question arises what will change after the recognition of Southern Ocean So the concern of the R is the changing temperature of the ocean water due to climate change Global warming is affecting the temperature of the water and the southern ocean water is getting warmer which is affecting the distinctive ecology of the ocean i hope all the points were clear to you so this is all for now you were listening arav on study wind if you got some knowledge from our video then subscribe the channel like share and comment suggestions regarding improvement are wholeheartedly welcome you can follow us on instagram for any of your queries thanks for watching stay safe stay happy have a good day